morning, I think we're still before noon, and welcome down to the kennel at Wendy Hill Kennel. Uh, we're going to shoot these again this morning from in the kennel. This is Daisy's kids. Oh, I'm sorry, I scared you. Uh, they're all doing phenomenal. Let's see if I can turn it sideways. Ugh. And uh, they're getting fat, as you can tell from their photos and with their weights on them. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through here and uh, hold each one of them up, let you see them. They're not moving around a whole lot yet. <clears throat> Thank goodness, or I couldn't catch them. Uh, this is the little black and white female. I wish you had feel the vision videos. This is the softest coat. Oh my golly, this whole litter is like velvet. Uh, she's doing super good. She needs her face trimmed again today, so we're probably going to trim her face. Uh, I think they've, they're going to get a bath today. Uh, they haven't had a bath yet, and they are so much babyfied. They really need to be perked up a little bit, and a bath usually seems to do that. So today they're going to get their first bath, which is really good. They're three weeks and three days old, so it's time for their, usually their third week we give them a bath, sometimes their second. But these guys have been so clean. Daisy does a phenomenal job keeping these puppies clean. So today they get a bath, which will kind of scare the daylights out of them, but it's time to start them on the road to becoming little grown-up for kids. So today's bath day. <clears throat> um, let's see, what else can I tell you as I go along? Toenails have been cut every week. Uh, they actually feel like they almost need cut again. Let's do a different color since we did the party. This is the tiniest one in the litter. This is the little male. He is such a cute puppy. He is still available. He has got just phenomenal amounts of huge coat. Huge, huge coat and just as sweet as pie. Um, he's gonna stay little. I don't think he's gonna get much bigger than his mom from the size of him. I think these guys will maybe go 10 or 11 pounds. I think this guy's gonna go nine or 10 pounds. He's really tiny. Uh, just a sweet boy. Just being, they're still in their well box. We're gonna dump them out this week. Probably today after the bath, we're gonna dump them out and blow their, blow their mind. They're in a four foot cubicle with their mother and their welt box is in there, which is what the box they're born in. And so today when they lose that, they're kind of probably freak out for a little bit, but that's good for them. It gets their mind thinking and new, um, new things that you do to them make their mind change all the time and makes them progress. So today will be a good thing getting their bath done. Hi, Pumpkin. Okay, this is the black and white male. This guy is phenomenal fat. He's just a fat butterball. Huge, 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 huge coat. Super, super soft. They're just like velvet and so clean. Um, for a first mom to keep her litter this clean, it's really a good sign of how good a mom she is. I swore I wasn't gonna do another litter with Daisy because I didn't like these little tiny guys, but I may end up keeping Daisy. Um, Leo's a, a favorite of ours. He was super tiny when he was born. He actually went to Children's Hospital in a bag and went up to intensive care for a little boy to be able to play with him that couldn't have his dog. And my next door neighbor works as an intensive care nurse. So she sneaked him upstairs to see him because he was not expected to have a good outcome on his health. So Leo's kind of special around here. Uh, okay, the last one in here is the Merle. He is the biggest in the litter. I think he's the first one who takes all the faucets. But uh, just phenomenal coat. I love the yin yang face, and I love the markings on this guy. He has the most awesome coat. And just for fun, you're trying to bite my pants, aren't you, little man? Let me show you the difference in these two puppies. Uh, head size is almost double the size with this guy. And uh, let me set you both down here. Can you sit down even? But there's a huge difference between the biggest and the smallest. Um, just awesome coloring on this puppy, and they're just they're just doing phenomenal well. I can't say enough about how mom has done with them. So um, let me hold them all up here, and you can get a face picture. Next week, I hope to put them outside on the ground. This will be good if I can get all their faces going the right direction. Let me put the girl down here on the corner, split up the black and white. So there we go for faces. Hopefully, they stay looking at you and the little guy doesn't sink down in the bottom under my arms. No, you gotta stay in here, buddy. But uh, just, 
Daisy's crew is just awesome. And uh, hey, I put you up here to keep your head up, and now you're both going over the bottom. You guys are just babies. So if you have any questions on these guys, how they're doing, uh, please give me a call. They're phenomenally good. If you want to book in for me uh, for pickup and know the date you want, it always makes a great thing if you can book in early. And uh, again, this little black guy is the one that's still available. But they're doing phenomenal. And I hope you enjoyed their video and their photos this week. And uh, we'll talk to you later.